That's all that's left after an alleged arson attack in Coronationville. The reason? The war between the fast guns and the Farados gangs. You see my daughter and a child like that? Jubeda Krut admits that her daughter is involved with a member of the fast guns. Three family members are in critical condition following the attack. So my daughter and the child got badly burned. And me and my other daughter's child jumped out of the window. And his mother was laying behind the two beds. So she got out last. So they in ICU, our lounge, span, TV, like a lot of things. One community activist says colored communities have been abandoned by law enforcement. So while the gangs are fighting, our people are dying. The police regards this area as not important. It's either it's, it's, it's people getting robbed, it's either there's a whole lot of things that happens, but law enforcement with regards to coronation or Westbury and all these colored areas, they're not interested. Police have opened a case of arson and attempted murder. Police responded to a call about a flat that was on fire in Coronationville. Preliminary investigations suggest that the fire was caused by three males who were seen in the area. While the search for the suspects is underway, Groot and her family will live in constant fear, not knowing whether they'll be attacked again. Slinda Lomasigan, Johannesburg.